Welcome to the new Hilti Profus Engineering Suite Anchoring to Concrete Design Module. It will just take a moment to walk through the features here, including how to customize your settings. From the header bar, you can access help functions and take virtual tours of useful features. You can also access your profile information from this screen, as well as settings such as file name, storage location, design codes, units, and default values. In the navigation pane, the Home button will take you back to the setup screen. The other buttons here are specific to anchoring in concrete. The options appear in order from the bottom to the top of the application, starting with the base material, followed by the base plate, anchor, profile, and finally the loads. Each option opens the corresponding design input fields. The Favorites section comes preloaded with the design parameters that Hilti Profus Engineering Suite users most often need. Most regular designs can be done by changing design parameters here. You can further customize your design by choosing your own design inputs. Under Base Material, you can change your concrete properties such as strength, temperature, and installation conditions. In the Base Plate section, you can change base plate properties such as shape, dimensions, standoff, and material. Under Anchors, you can change anchor type and layout. Create non-standard anchor layouts by opening the 2D editor. Under Profile, you can change your profile shape, size, and position. With the Loads function, you can indicate whether the load is static or seismic before inputting the respective design parameters. In the 3D model, you can click and adjust different dimensions. Here, you can undo or redo changes, change the display settings on the 3D model, and change the selected anchor. You can see the different load combinations here, along with corresponding anchors. In the output pane, the utilization metric is showing the capacity of the anchor that's being used. Notifications show any inconsistencies in the inputs that need to be corrected in order to get a valid solution. You can also check recommendations to get a potentially better solution. In the output pane, you can save your work as a template or export the output as a report, Profus design file, or a BIM or CAD file. Thanks for watching. We hope you found this tutorial helpful.